<laughs> Takes yeah. you whole guy <laughs> to read them. Thank you. I look forward to sitting down and enjoying all the comments. And so thank you so much. And there is a small thing in the envelope too, so. Oh, yeah. okay. Costco, my Yay! 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 So, anytime we have a staff meeting, I bring Costco. Ah, yeah. <laughs> we will miss those. So perfect, thank you very and much. When we went to oh my gosh. Oh, how great. Oh, that's wonderful. Yeah. My gosh. Thank you very much. You've seen this already, maybe yeah, not? Yeah, yeah. Okay, all right. Yeah. Here you go. Oh, really? oh that's really neat. Thank it was you so much. So right over the fireplace. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Not in the fireplace. In the fireplace. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Yeah, you know, I put it in the bathroom, <laughs> Ron. <laughs> Ouch. Yeah. Could you read? Did you know when I said that? Yeah. I didn't even know that we took those pictures. <laughs> and Julie, can you hold it up? Hey, oh. how are you? Okay. Yeah, so Just a picture, right? So do you think... I'm oh, doing the video. Because he did. Thank you. So we came back last night. Chilis. Yeah, this is chilis for sure, but I do cannot remember what... I think that was a Christmas. Sorry. That's a cool little camera there. Whoa. Hi. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is me, Miss Two People, for sure. No Thanks, Zaren. Oh, no, Angelique did the whole thing. Oh, oh, I'll have to go say hi to Angelique. So, yeah. Thanks for setting this up for her. Oh, there's Ike and Zareen. We all put together, and then also Good. Vanessa. So. All right. Good job. I'll have to this is nice. thank Vanessa, too. Thank you for the contribution. Really? I don't know. I heard you help set some of this up. <clears throat> good, good. Thanks for doing that. It's a GoPro. Oh my gosh. Say hi to Ron. Hi, Ron. Good luck. It was fun. Got an interview place set up if you want to do a oh, that's awesome. one on one later on. Has Ron ever rejected a PTO request of yours? No, he hasn't. No? No, he's never done that. He's that kind of guy, you know. He's a yes kind of guy. He never that's says right. no. <laughs> Ron, uh, no man's poor as long as he's rich in friends and family, and you're the richest man I know. Happy trails, Ron. Good luck. Thanks for everything. No, I mean, yes, ask question. So, Elena, <laughs> have you ever worked for somebody nicer than Ron? No. No? He's, he's the easiest person with whom I can work. Are you going to miss him? not the right word. Not just me. You I will miss him? very much. Yeah. I will. I am ready even to, ready to cry that he is missing because we love him a lot and thank him a lot for everything what he does. anything you want to say to Mr. Brainy? Oh, working with you and your team, awesome. I'm really going to miss you. So I'll I'll keep hassling your team and and killing them with chicken. Any last words for Mr. Schwartz, for Mr. Brainy on his last day? Really, Ron? You're going to leave me? Yeah. I High can't believe it. Yeah. High and dry. Take now what am you. I supposed to do? <laughs> now listen, if you're going to go down to Mexico, if you're going to go down to the Mexico and sit on the beach and drink beer, let me know. I'll join you. <laughs> hey, Michael, but, should, should Brianie retire? Actually, I thought he already was retired. I didn't really see him around much the last three or four months. Oh. But um, no, no, seriously, uh, yeah, if I could retire, I would. So good luck, Ron. Hey, Roel, would you ever want to tackle Briny for no reason at all? <laughs> Hell no. He works out every day. He kicked my butt. Six people aren't specifically sitting up here as like a tribunal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I would have imagined people would have sat there already. Yeah. Help. Yeah, where is that what guy? You want to get my face in this one? Are you videotaping? <laughs> uh, now I think I am. Ron's been great knowing you. Best of luck. <laughs> Good luck, retirement. He'd probably be bored within a month. Yeah. <laughs> well, he won't. Month guys will be sitting around going, what the hell was I thinking? <laughs> Why didn't I leave sooner is what he'll be thinking. Yes, exactly. Yeah. He'll be finally coming out of shock and realizing there's like a real world outside of here. Exactly. Yeah. Any last words Thanks. for Mr. Briney? Good luck and uh, come back anytime. All right. Yeah, hope to see you again and thank you for everything. We're going to miss you. Have you ever heard Ron Briney raise his voice for any reason? 
No, I never heard it. Probably it was somewhere inside, you know, but he was keeping it so much, you know, to himself, even though everybody else was screaming, kind of, probably. So he is so nice, you know, just to tolerate all of us and just not to raise voice. He's like my hero. <laughs> hey, Chris, when do you think Briny's hair turned gray? Uh, I think the first day on the job at Care Fusion is when it happened. Yeah? Yeah. All right. Hey, hey Jay, uh, when do you think Ron Briney's hair turned gray? When he hired Bob Cook. <laughs> hey, Gus, what's what's the most demanding thing Ron has ever asked of you? Well, he always asks a lot of things technically, but he gets his answer by good attitude, actually. And uh, I learned a lot from him. So really, uh, I'm very, very pleased. To work with him, and I am really sorry to miss him. Hey, Chris, uh, what's your favorite memory of Ron? So my favorite memory of Ron was <clears throat> one day I saw Jeremy and Ron walking down the hallway, and they had a serious look on their face because they were talking about something. And I walked up to them and I said, "Hey, Ron, Jeremy," and I just walked away. And Jeremy had to explain to Ron who Ron Jeremy was. Good time. Famous last words for the GoPro for Mr. Briney. <laughs> Good luck. Happy, nice yep, happy trails. Thanks for coming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To record this video. Ron was uh, bragging moments ago that uh, all the assignments I put him on to begin with never shipped. Guess whose mind? <laughs> guess who, what other name came to mind? <laughs> because I remember you saying that too. Yeah. Yes, I so, had that. Patient station. I was thinking. I remember you using this one once in the lab, right? Uh, the GoPro? No, I think that's the one over there. Uh, okay. I was gonna set up. A, you should rename it Patient you Station. You had to have a lot of patience because it never. Hey, Marco, uh, who, who should Brian yell at for no reason at all? For one last time, because I want to see him mope around, is uh, Bob Cook. Are you ready to bow? Ready, Zach? Wait, you took Surge's back. Look at the face. Look at the face. Surge's back? Give him a face. I didn't take Surge's back. Which face? His purse. The mopey face? <laughs> what are you asking me? <laughs> Why Jeremy hired Surge? <laughs> nice hire. <laughs> hey, hey, Hoss, would you go skydiving, tandem skydiving with Ron Brady? It would be interesting because I would want to know if he was going to hug me. Well, like, if he's going to be the guy that's the professional and hugging me, or am I going to be hugging him? And it'll be like Titanic in the air. Hey, Eddie, uh, like, what color would Ron Briney's lowrider be? Uh, it would probably be black. Black? Yeah. yeah. Would you help him make Metallic. it? Metallic. Metallic? Nice. What about the wheels? With some, uh, maybe some 13 inch spokes. Okay. Uh, <laughs> so, Thomas, uh, instead of being an SQE manager, what should Ron have been instead? I think uh, instead of Ron being an SQE manager, <clears throat> he should be a good, a really good teacher, because he not really teach us um, how how to do, how to handle all the technical stuff, and he he's always teach us how to um, how to be the, the right person, how to um, associate with other people with the right behavior. So that's why we love Ron Friday and we don't want to miss him. We don't want him him to leave Capuchin. Hey, so uh, what do you think Briny is always writing in his planner? Gym schedule. That's gym what it schedule? is. Gym schedule. Yeah? <laughs> hey, nice. After Ron retires, where do you think you're most likely to find him? Um, maybe coming back as an RA, like Hal. <laughs> hey, Hal, uh, do you think Ron could ride a bike across the country? I'm sure he could if he felt inspired, but, you know, I think he has other things he wants to do, and... I am saving him a place down in our work group. We have these special desks, and I know Ron might come out of retirement to get to be able to work in that environment. I've told him this, and he says no, but I, I, I'm going to put a reservation uh, on one of the empty desks when I get back upstairs uh, and hold it for a year or so, and then we'll see if Ron comes back. But all seriously, uh, I, I hope that Ron's retirement lasts longer than mine. Uh, which is nine months, and uh, I wish Ron all the best. Um, I actually have known Ron for over 30 years, worked with him at another company, and uh, we went our separate ways for 20 years, and it was great to have him back uh, for 10 years here at uh, Cardinal, Pixis, Care Fusion, whatever the current name is. <laughs> what are you going to miss most about Ron? Um, well, I 
I'm gonna miss him, his, his smile every morning, and I just wanted to say, Ron, that uh, it was a pleasure having to um, be able to, to hear about your family and your grandchildren, and and we get updates and pictures from you. Those we're gonna really miss because it's, you know, we we work very hard. We put. Are so much of our lives into our workplace but but it's having a relationship with each other I think is the most precious and knowing each other's family and and the things that really matters the most <laughs> so I, I'm gonna miss that um, chance to always um, talk about the family and our, our workplace so we're gonna miss you one two three hi Ron I remember back in 2006 when I had an interview with you and many other wonderful managers like Jeremy, Sangeeta, Jack, Hal and um, I remember that I got the offer from Cardinal Hall. At the same time, I have the offer from another company and I asked my agent that who is going to be my manager and I just specifically was thinking about you and as soon as that she said it's going to be Ron Briney, I just accept the offer and I, that was one of the best things that I ever did. And it was so pleasure working with you. I learned a lot from you. That the last seven years was a wonderful, wonderful time that I have here with you, with all the team members at all the time. I say it's not team, this is like a family that, that we have here. And um, few things that we really love about you was that under all the stress, you never ever raise your voice. You never put all those pressure on our like a, a team at all. We never felt it. And uh, all the time you telling us that family come first. And we are going for sure miss you a lot. But you know me, I don't let you go. <laughs> I will be in touch with you for sure. We will get together. Many picnics, many baby shower, I promise you. So we will be together. Thank you so much for everything.